I'm on my <laughs> eighth year, and um, this will be around uh, three more years, and this will include the various shows as well. And of course, the next few shows will be uh, the Clash season four, and uh, uh, All Out Sundays as well. But what I'm really looking forward to, kapag uh, yung Philippines and or yung mundo eh, medyo okay na are the tours again. Yung mga GMA Pinoy TV tours, regional TV tours. Ang sarap siguro mag-travel at kumanta again. Yung first question ko sa'yo, Christian, is parang I'm sure with the the number of years you've been in show business, maraming beses ka nang pumerma ng mga ganitong klaseng kontrata. But what makes this contract renewal or signing of contract with GMA special for you today? Uh, kanina nangyari yun eh. Um, pero sa ngayon parang ang pinaka na special na nangyari kanina parang nag-show like sila ng isang BTR. And then, naalala ko, ang dami na pala nating nagawa together. And, telling me na they want me again for a few more years during a pandemic felt really, really nice. Na naging emotional ako kanil. And all my bosses were there. Na para congratulating me, thanking me. Napaka, napaka sarap ng feeling. Parang, wow, uh, meron mga tao pa rin na naniniwala sa akin. At this time, at my age, it, it was a very nice feeling. Since now na nag-renew ka na ulit ng contract mo with GMA, so uh, for you, what is the best part of being a kapuso and what you enjoyed most? Uh, best part is to really be with people who love working together, uh, who have a common purpose, and who look out for each other. And uh, Christian, you mentioned a while ago, no, na parang naging uh, emotional ka kapag uh, nagkaroon ka ng, or nung nakareceive ka ng mga projects or new offer. Uh, balikan ko lang kasi uh, nagkaroon ka before ng IG post wherein you also got emotional during the rehearsal ng Steel. So, Yeah, where in uh, you mentioned there, parang napatanong ka about your purpose, about is it matagal ka na ba ulit na nakakuha ng script? And you also mentioned there a quote na parang uh, be still and know that God is there. So, um pag babalikan natin yung time na yon, um is it like ngayon ba may mga kasagutan na yon and is it like you have new realizations pagdating sa personal life mo or sa career mo? Um Nung time na yon kasi, uh, as an artist, especially last year, parang, ano gagawin natin? Hindi na tayo pwede mag-show. Paano na? Gano'ng katagal ba to? So kaya lahat tayo nag-online, di ba? And then magbibigyan ka nga ng project na bubble or whatever. Ang sarap, ang sarap makakuha ng project uh, as an artist during this time. So I'm grateful for GMA, I'm grateful for View, I'm grateful to God as well na, na hindi ako pinapabaya. Uh, before signing, kasi kanina medyo natanong na yung mga ano nila. Before signing, uh, pumasok ba sa isip mo na stop muna ako or stop muna ngayon dahil may pandemic, stop muna or continue na lang pag okay na yung, ano, yung mundo natin? Pumasok ba sa isip mo yung ganun? Uh, sa isip ko, hindi hindi umi, hindi pumasok ang mag-stop. Sa isip ko, gusto ko pa rin magtuloy-tuloy. But I also respect all the other people na who are in a different uh, state na who might want to rest. Naiintindihan ko yung tanong mo. Kasi meron ibang tao parang pinifigure out muna mm-hmm. uh, kung ano yung next step nila. Pero sa ngayon, ang mindset ko is go lang ng go. Uh, was, the next question is, sa tingin mo, uh, di ba, pang eight years, pang eight year mo na with uh, GMA, sa tingin mo, uh, dito ka mag-re-retire? Na, nas, natanong na rin sa akin yan. It's a very good question. Ang uh, sagot ko is, as long as they would have me, mm-hmm. I will be there for them. 
Okay. Um, yesterday, the Metropolitan Theater um, actually opened, um, and you were part of that um, in the celebration. How was it like the experience of performing on a stage? Grabe, no? Parang, wow, meron na ulit live show. Uh, yung audience nga lang was two seats apart. Pero, alam mo yun, uh, we're following the rules. Pero, ang sarap. Nasa stage, may lights, may mic, may audience. So, na nakamas, na nakasocial distance. Pero, ang sarap ng feeling. Eh, giving you a glimpse of what it was and what it can be again. Di ba? Parang, wow. Here we go. So, I think the new future will be a mix. Eh. Mm-hmm. Na, meron pa rin mga online shows, obviously. Pero habang dumadami na ulit ng live shows, how now to blend both avenues? Pero excited to go live again. Iba pa rin kasi talaga ang live. Talagang feel mo ang energy ng bawat isa. And uh, you're obviously going to be part of history as one of the few performers who were invited in that uh, particular show. Um, uh, the Clash is also nominated uh, for New York Festival's uh, TV and Film Awards. Uh, when you heard the news, of course, that's not just an accomplishment per se for the show itself, but it, you as an individual artist, um, how does that feel for you? Na, I was doing something right pala <laughs> during the last season that was able to contribute to everyone. Pero that award is as a show, right? So. Mm-hmm. It, it deserves uh, recognition then for our directors, writers, producers, co-artists, co-hosts, contestants. To be part of it, it's a feeling. To be recognized. First question is, now that The Clash is gearing up for season four, what do you think uh, makes it click to the audience and what keeps you motivated as a straightforward and somehow strict panelist? I think what keeps the audience motivated is um, merong mga segments ang The Clash na kakaiba na hindi mo nakikita sa mga usual singing contest. And again, ang lagi kong sinasabi sa mga press ko na ang pinakagusto ko talaga ay yung maghahanap sila ng ka-duet partner. Hopefully maganda yung duet nila. Pag nanalo sila, mag-move sila sa next round. Kapag natalo sila, maglalaban sila. I think that's just genius. Next is... Um, Uh, being a straightforward judge, I I do my best to be straightforward yet constructive at okay. hindi nagpuput down. Pero I also need to be that kind of judge para mas mabilis sila sanang matuto. I'm also always saying na kasi minsan ang bashing sa akin eh ikaw rin naman nagkakamali, ikaw rin naman natalo, ikaw rin naman, bakit ganyan ka? So, ang sinasabi ko lang is, because, yes, I am not perfect, yes, I did uh, all those mistakes before, pero as a judge, on that seat, on that time slot, I have to do my job. To be a good judge, and to really tell the contestants what they need to hear, so that they will become better. Walang sugar coating, di ba? Yes. Oo, at least... Konting drizzle lang. Konting ano lang. Konting... Oo, candy sprinkle mas- lang. <laughs> Oo, masyika para... Ito, ito yung ganawin mo. Parang ganon. Mm. Nanonood ako actually. Oh, thanks. Okay. From Stars Photog, uh, from Alan, um, na na... Nasagot mo na ito kanina pero kailangan siguro natin ng details. Um, how many years ang pinirmahan mong kontrata sa GMA? At kasama pa rin ba ang acting project sa kontrata mo? May nakaline up ka ba na teleserye? It is more or less mga three years uh, kasama ang acting. As of teleserye, none yet kasi we're focusing on The Clash and All Out Sundays. Kasi yung mga teleserye ngayon, couples, di ba? Pero meron akong uh, project with the online platform VIU. VIU. Uh, ang title niya is Still. Kasama ko po dyan si Julian San Jose. At tatapusin na po namin yung uh, shoot niyan in a, maybe next month. Oo. Isang question na lang. What made you decide to continue your contract with GM7 sa kabila ng nangyayaring lipatan ng artista sa iba-ibang network? 
Uh, anong nagawa ng GMA sa maganda mong career now? Yun ang question. Um, lagi silang merong uh, binibigay na project po sa akin. And, pero of course, nangyayari po yun kasi uh, thankfully nagugustahan po nila yung ginagawa ko. At nakakadagdag po ako sa shows, whether sa Clash or sa All Out Sundays. Um, I've been there yung uh, that moment when you would want to move to a station or to a company. I've been there. And we're always just looking out for uh, parang what's next in our lives. And uh, for this season in my life, it is still with Jim. And I'm happy that uh, they wanted me as well. And uh, as long as they would have me, I would be there for them. Um, Nare-realize ko na how uh, important you guys are through the years na sinasamahan nyo kami sa mga uh, blog cons na ito or press con. We are just so grateful for you kasi even though this is also your profession, you really help us as artists as well. And uh, together, uh, you are a part of our journey. So maraming salamat. What is my journey so far right now? Patulad ng sinabi niyo rin kanina, nag-vlog na po tayo sa YouTube, Christian J.M. Bautista. Patuloy pa rin ang All Out Sundays. Magkakaroon po ng The Clash Season 4. Meron po kami project ni Julie. It's called Still Under View. And patuloy pa rin ang gaming sa x Bautista. Patuloy pa rin ang Kumu sa x Bautista. At uh, Please follow the social media, uh, all my social media na Action Bautista or Christian Bautista sa Facebook and or Instagram. Nandiyan na tayo sa TikTok. Sorry, pero nandiyan na tayo. Nandiyan na rin tayo sa Laika. At kung ano pang bago, tatalon din po siguro tayo ito. Pero as of the moment, salamat dahil na uh, tulong-tulong tayo kahit online, kahit digital, keep entertainment alive keep the arts alive and uh, maraming salamat po sa inyo and again thank you to Jim